Hello everyone. This video I'm recording uh, to help thousands of students or academicians who are trying to use Blast Ring Image Generator in their Windows platform. While I was uh, trying to help uh, with the Blast Ring Image Generator, I found out a lot of difficulties uh, trying to use it on Windows machine. Mine is a Windows 10 machine. That's what I thought it's important for me to share so that many other people trying to use it can get ahead very quickly. Anyway, in order to, as a first step actually, you need to Google search Brick Blast Ring Image Generator and then this one comes up as it takes you to Source Forge and it tells you to download Brick. So There you go. It's going to download the file in your platform. While it downloads, I'm going back and I'm going to read the installing brick. It's very important. There it says to run the go and download this one and then run it. Then it's not over. You have to install Blast. So Brick uses Blast in order to provide its output. That's why you need to install Blast as well. So you click on here, the latest version of Blast. It gives you, it takes you to the latest versions. From here, you need to find out what is suitable for your computer. Mine is a 64-bit Windows. That's why I will be using a Win64.exe, the CXE file. You click here. And it gets downloaded. I will show you next that even installing these two are not necessarily enough. If you don't have a Java installed, JDE installed, it will not work. It will give you an error message. I'll show you in my next video. But for now, these are the two the executable files that you need to download and install in your PC. One thing to note, you need to have administrative right, I think, I'm not sure, to install this in your PC. If you do not have an administrative right, Try to talk to your IT and get this installed without any errors. Thank you guys. In my next video, I'll show you how to install these two files.